welcome to Fuji International Speedway in beautiful Japan for a return for Lamborghini Super Trofeo Asia. The first time in almost exactly four years we were here at this iconic circuit. This is the third round of the 2023 season. set for two 50-minute races across this Super Formula weekend here at Fuji Speedway. Temperatures in the low 30s, humidity is quite high, as uh, most people that know this region understand only too well. The beautiful Mount Fuji only appears every now and then, and we've seen it a couple of times during the course of this weekend, but it's been very, very patchy so far as cloud coming across the rain. A little bit of light drizzle, that did affect things during the opening qualifying session. And some of the drivers also explaining that perhaps the Super Formula sessions just immediately beforehand on a slightly different time were up with these Lamborghini Huracans Super Trofeos compete on had changed the track surface a little bit slippery so we saw times just a fraction down on the, what we may well have expected but of course this is the Evo 2 version of the Huracans Super Trofeo They have the inside run, so that is likely a change for position. Now, there's been an improvement up front. 141.8 last time round for Chris Vanderdrift at 42. I can't stop watching this one. Zico and uh, Jilong Kang are out in position oh, tonight. Yeah, about one and a half seconds over Keith Vong. Bond is still holding on to position number four. He's got a one point. Miko Nassi is absolutely storming 
If we have a look at Mika Nassi's last lap time, he did a 43.9 to a 44.6 for John Kwon. So John lost seven tenths of a second, and I think that leads only down to about half a second. So that would be a position change for the number 63 entry and for their debut with the new Safe House Racing entry. Now that's a great result for Wei Liang Ni and Miko Nassi if they can manage to move themselves into position number five and that would be second in Pro-Am if Wei Liang Ni in the number 77 entry that he shares with Miko Nassi who did a brilliant job in the closing stages to work his way up to four and second in Pro-Am they'll be back on the podium and very happy about that on their debut with Safe House. They uh, will seven, not be on the top step for the fifth Bico. race. They haven't been able to make it a uh, Max Verstappen-esque clean sweep, but they are back bottleneck down. And unfortunately for us, Relang Ni and uh, Nico Nassi on screen going nuts uh, in the safe house number 77 entry. New car for them this weekend in position number four and second in Pro-Am. The boy show me the show me the trophy again. In the toilet. Yeah. I mean you're washing it, right? Yeah. Gotta wash it. Yeah. Nice. Mm, see, clean yeah. boys. Oh, no, stop walking. You don't, you don't Hi. Wanna see the I don't want to see the toilet bowl. Okay. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Very, very pretty. Yeah, so third round Lamborghini Super Trophy Asia at Fuji Speedway was really good for us. Uh, we had a lot of Bybit guests in our hospitality lounge, just amazing to have them there. And uh, a lot of them got to sign our car as well, which is just uh, amazing to have something unique on the car for us when uh, we're going around the racetrack. Yeah, so race, race one, we started off with a bang. We got second in class and Wei started the race and brought it to the pit stop during safety car to me and I was able to go from there all the way up to fourth overall and second in class. So me mega race and really good result. Yeah, race two was uh, interesting. We had an amazing start. I was starting in fifth place and then by the end of lap one, we were third, third overall and at that point, second in category as well. So really good start. Unfortunately, we had a little bit of a slow pit stop. So we came into the pits second in class, but then the slow pit stop dropped us a little bit. And then uh, we just missed out on the class podium, but we also had great performance overall. Pace was good. We just need to uh, practice a little bit more on our pit stops and then uh, we'll keep getting the podiums.